but we're gonna get it together before we even start our day before i even talk to y'all we gotta say our morning prayer there's something i'm trying to get in two more i'm sorry if kingston's tv is really loud but i'm trying to just pray like before I even really just getting my day started so and i'm also trying to get kingston in the habit of you know teaching him that there is a creator and you know all that stuff so come here kingston Stop running, please. Let's say our morning prayer. Hold my hand. Are you Peter? Yes. What is that? He fell asleep in his clothes, y'all, so. Bow your head. Close your eyes. Dear God. Dear God. I pray. Pray. That you make. Made. That you make. Made. Today a great day. day. I pray. Pray. I don't even know what to say. Sometimes I just don't know what to say. Sometimes I can speak. Like for so long and just know what I want. Well, okay, we we gonna keep it short and simple today, okay? Okay. Okay, let's start over. Dear God, dear God, today, today will be a great day. Great day. I know. I know that you will guide me. Guide me in the the right direction. I am. I love you so much, mommy. Say, I love you so much. Love you so much. And thank you, thank you for how far, Too far you have brought me already. Brought me already. Thank you, thank you for waking me up. Thank you for waking me up. And I pray, pray that you keep. Let me do that again. That you keep. Keep. Kingston, stop playing now. This ain't the time to play with them eye boogers in your nose. I mean them eye boogers in your eyes. I'm taking this serious. This ain't no time to play. You understand? Okay, come on. He don't make me mess up. It ain't funny, Kingston. When we talking to God, it's not funny. I forgot what I was saying. Oh, I pray that you keep everyone that I love safe. And I pray that you guide them in the right direction as well. Amen. 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 Yeah, good job. Anyways, good morning, you guys. I hope that you all have a wonderful day. I hope that this video brings you a little bit of happiness, a little bit of peace, a little bit of comfort. If you are new to my channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And as you can see by the title, we're just doing, you know, a little mom vlog. Just another vlog documenting my life, really. Let me just tell y'all what I have planned for today. Because I really feel like I've just been slacking. Like, I, honestly, I did not start my new year off on a good note. But it's never too late to get it right. Like, I just been really lazy. Like, waking up super late. Like, super late. I used to complain about waking up at, like, 12. I've been waking up super late. And it's been... Kingston has just been up eating anything he want to eat. And it's it's crazy and i can't i can't do that as a mom so yeah we're gonna try to do better well we we're, we're doing better okay because i woke up at eight today i think thanks to my sister kiana for blowing me up and she wouldn't let me hang up she wouldn't let me go back to sleep she was talking my ear off so i finally just decided to get up so um my task for today is to film a sit down video um film three tiktoks because i am trying to take my tiktok more serious and be more consistent because yeah tiktok bring the money too i just don't be consistent when i was consistent i was getting like a lot of sponsorships and stuff and that has really slowed down so i'm trying to do at least three tiktoks a day closet clean out i need to clean my closet figure out what i want to give away what i want to put on depop my face is itching so bad bro why maybe because i fell asleep in my makeup i washed my face though Ugh. 
so yeah i had to make a new depop as well so that will be linked down below and i'm gonna be selling some real cute stuff some of the stuff still has tags on it and i never sell it for expensive at all nothing i'll be over 15 dollars most of the time if it's over that i paid a lot i promise so y'all go check out my depop and i want to plan content for kingston's channel i told y'all we was gonna start that in the new year something he really wants to do so i'm gonna really take the time out and plan that and see how like i'm gonna manage my channel and his channel and figure out like the uploading schedule because i do want to upload at least once a week i feel like that's good enough for him of course as his channel continues to grow we'll probably you know upload more frequently but for now once a week is good oh and i need to do bible study that's in my self-care section i'm gonna have this link down below as well this planner because a lot of y'all be asking where i got it from so yeah, I'm going to just link that down below. And then in the I'm grateful for section, I put that I'm grateful for the creator, my son, my internet family, and just being alive. And then in the notes section, I wrote down a couple of affirmations. So here are my affirmations for today. Um, I did listen to some waking up like on a YouTube video. So what I've been trying to do is like listen to the same video for like an entire month and then when the new month comes i switch to another um video of affirmations and that way it's just really getting stuck in my head like i really do like truly believe like this is my life this is gonna happen even though i believe in this stuff anyway it's just a reminder to me like i'm a very delusional person which is sometimes well most of the time well it depends on how you use it but i'm delusional like can't nobody tell me my life is gonna not be great. I've always been delusional, yes. <laughs> and I, it has led me to great heights and very low lows. But anyway, it's my affirmations for today that I wrote. Cause I just be writing whatever comes to my mind. So I put, I am rich. And when I say rich, I'm not only talking about money. When I say rich, like I am rich when it comes to knowledge i am rich when it comes to health not just money because it's way more to life than money i am happy i am exactly where i should be because you can't rush god's timing okay and i am a great mother so yeah those are my affirmations for today i'm sitting down for a little minute because my stomach is hurting I don't know, but sometimes I love avocado toast. Like, I love that shit. I will eat that shit for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But sometimes when I eat it, my stomach be hurting so bad. It really makes my throat itch a little bit. Y'all think I'm allergic? What if that's why my face itching? Yeah, I'm going to try to get all my tasks done today. And I'm going to just bring y'all along with me. I love y'all so much. I've just been so at peace this year so far, though. Like, even though I haven't been doing much... I'm not stressing about it. I feel like everything is going exactly how it should be going. And I'm happy. Can't nothing wrong with my mood. I want to feel like this the whole year. And I hope that y'all feel the same way. So Enough rambling. Um, I don't know what task I'm going to start off with. Make sure y'all follow the business page. <laughs> Get into it. Look how the girl is sitting. Like, do you see them? Don't play. Oh, you can't excuse the message. It doesn't rain. Southern California is on the matches. But boy, if I've been thinking about you, you know, no, no. Do you think about it? Do you think so far? Okay. I'm about to clean this closet. We got the. You know, do something. I don't know, but 
it's always been kind of crowded, but look at this shit, y'all. Look at this shit. Do not judge me. Look at this. Just look. I can't step. Like, just. This is embarrassing. I know. Just look. This is crazy. So, I'm about to go through all these clothes. I'm about to get a trash bag. We're going to go through the clothes. The stuff that, like, I feel like I've had for too long or it's just, like, super old, out of style or whatever. I'm going to just take that to, like, um, what's that store called? It's not Goodwill. It's, check, what is it called? Play those closet because, you know, they give y'all a little money for it. I think you can only take one bag at a time. So, yeah, I'm debating on if I want to do Kingston's today. But if I have time, I will. I don't know, because I got to film my video. But that shouldn't take long, though. But, yeah, let's just go through this closet. I don't feel like doing this, but it got to get done. Don't get mustard and feed yum. 
Huh? Don't get mustard at 3 a.m. Don't get mustard at 3 a.m. Yeah. Why? Because this doesn't happen to you. Something will happen to me? Mm -hmm. What will happen to me? The mustard come in your room. Monster will come in my room mm -hmm. if I go get mustard at 3 a.m. Yeah. You know what I'm gonna do to the monster? Yeah. Slaughter him. No. Monster will drink. He can't beat me. Yeah, monster will big. Really big? Yeah. Bigger than me? Um, I will call him right now. You will call him? Yeah. That's evil. <laughs> So, when I'm cooking lunch for Kingston, I try to make sure I always include a fruit. Like, always, whether it's strawberries, bananas, oranges, like, anything like that. Get off the floor! out! So, today his fruit is mandarin orange, y'all. Because I know some people be like, they don't go together, but it's like, shut the fuck up. That's I is going together! I know it go together because it's important for you to get everything you need, right? Yes. He need his protein. Yeah. He need his vitamin C. C. He need all that stuff, you know? So, I just always try to include <coughs> fruits. Some type of fruit. fruit. Sometimes I even do it for breakfast. And, yeah. But I do need to do better with, like, Doing vegetables for dinner. I feel like I be cooking the same stuff like green beans and stuff. And I'm trying to, you know, explore my options. Especially with him because he's picky. Like, I don't even. Do you like broccoli? No. Yeah, he doesn't like broccoli. So, I don't think he likes Brussels sprouts. I tried that. I love all vegetables, honestly. Like, I don't think I've tested a vegetable that I don't really like yet. I love cauliflower. I love broccoli, I love squash, green beans, asparagus. I know a lot of people don't like asparagus. I'm not a picky eater at all. Are chicken dinner ready? No, they're not ready. Mama, I'm taking longer. It's taking longer? Yeah. I'm sorry, you're gonna have to wait. You wanna eat it frozen? Yeah. Okay then. And then don't watch me. Is it good? change my whole closet around like this I don't know I was just tired of that like being the first thing I see when I walk in like I don't know 
I don't even know the purpose of this thing. Like, look at it. I was going to use it for my jeans, but I don't even wear jeans like that. I don't even have a lot of pair of jeans. <laughs> so, yeah, when I do start my little jean collection, then I'm going to just put all my jeans in here, I guess. But for now, it's just going to stay a mess like that. I said closet clean out, not closet makeover, okay? But, yeah, I, I like it better this way because I want to get some shoe, like the little acrylic shoe boxes and put in here. And I just feel like the dresses and stuff are in the way. And it'll look really good right there. Like stacked up. And this is getting on my nerves too. But. I don't know. We just gonna have to do it for right now. I don't know. <sighs> yeah. Doesn't look the best right now. But it's coming along. I was really. My goal for today was just to get rid of the old stuff. That I just didn't want. But. Oh, when I was cleaning, I hurt my nail, and now it's, like, really stinking. Like, I think I pulled it back too far. I'm about to finish um, putting the stuff up that I do want to keep. And, Mommy? yeah, we're going to go on to the next test. on your side it would be different if you made up a plan by yourself and was trying to get God to co-sign let me be patient let me be kind make me unselfish cause I'll be blind oh I may suffer
title, like, apartment hunting. You just moved into that one. And I'm gonna just be real honest with y'all. I don't like it here. I don't like it here. Like, I, this makes me feel like I could have stayed in Macon. And not the apartment complex itself, but I'm talking about where I actually live, like the county. This makes me feel like I did as could have stayed in Macon. Like, it's nothing here different. It's so much traffic for nothing. Like, it's nothing here. It's no reason for this to be all this traffic. That's what I feel like. like Anytime I want to do something, like fine for real, I have to go to the city because everything that is here is in making. So it's like, I just I just want to be closer to the city. I'm not far from the city, but I'm far, you know? So we're going to view an apartment today. And of course I'm gonna bring y'all with me. Yeah, I found one. It's like 40 minutes from here, y'all, so. Just imagine how far I stay from the city. <laughs> like, I don't stay. I probably stay like 30 minutes. So, I, if you're from here, you probably know. You probably know where I stay. Like, what county I stay in. Don't like it. I'm gonna be honest. Like, it's very peaceful. Don't get me wrong. Definitely pros. Like, I'm, I don't regret moving here, but it's just, I want something else. I want something new. I've stayed here for maybe six months. I think it's been six months. Seven, I don't know. But, yeah, I don't have no gel. I never do. And honestly, y'all, I don't, I don't even have no energy today. That's why I'm looking like a bomb. And me moving has actually been on my mind for a little minute. Like, ever since I really just got used to this, I just be looking around and I'm like, there's nothing different. And compared to this county, it's actually some stuff I like better in making. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Don't be up in my comments like, oh, you just moved here. Like, what? Don't do that because honestly, I don't give a fuck. And this is my life and this is my money. Maybe if you paid my rent, I would take into consideration what you got to say. But you don't. Ah, my edges are so cute. I was supposed to FaceTime my sister while... I was looking at it. I think she went to sleep because she got to work at three. And I'm not talking about the shanty. I'm talking about my sister on my dad's side. I know a lot of y'all been asking about them lately. Like, oh, do y'all talk again? And yes, we're, we're all on good terms. But I do talk to Kiana more than the rest. Like, way more. Like, we FaceTime every day. Probably the whole day when we can. I don't know if y'all know, but me and Kiana were born in the same month. So, what do they call those? Where... We're Irish, we're I Irish, Irish, we're Irish twins. So we're 20 days apart. She's like my bestie. Hey vlog, y'all see me? When you see me, you see her. You can even see her, cause she look black. <laughs> you wanna see her? Oh, hold on. When you see her, you see me. Anyways, y'all, I look a mess. I kinda look good in this light though. I, look a mess too. I just washed my face and used this, um, what's it called? It's like a glow serum. But yeah. Anyways, y'all, we're currently stuck in traffic. Yay! This is what it looks like. Let me show y'all. Mm -hmm. We got kinking in the back. This is the area I'm trying to be so y'all can understand where I live. What it give? It goes retired white couple. Exactly. <laughs> Up here it gives the lit young black girl in her 20s. Mm -hmm. And that's what we trying to get, okay? Are there schools up here? Mm. I'm sorry. Mm. The schools up here are amazing. Mommy. Amazing. If kids still don't like the apartment, it's a no-go. It's not too far. Like, y'all know she got sickle cell, so the hospital's literally... It's by the right. best fucking hospital, Grady. Yeah. Where I live, the hospital sucks, y'all. That's another reason I just don't want to be there. Like, I shouldn't have to wait... 13 hours in a waiting room and I'm having a fucking sickle cell crisis right now. Yeah, y'all trying crazy. to kill me? I'ma just give y'all a piece of advice for anybody that lives in Georgia, like live in Clayton County, Henry County. Do not go to Piedmont. Do not go to Piedmont, Henry. If y'all, y'all just gonna have to deal with that traffic going to Grady, but Grady is the best hospital. I'm not even gonna They even got a sickle cell unit. Yeah. And it, 
from where I'm looking at, it's only 18 minutes, I believe. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, that would be great. And Jenny's right down the street. Yeah, I am right there. So, I stay five minutes from the hospital. She stayed probably about 18 minutes. So it's not gonna be that hard to get there. I just think Atlanta is much better than McDonald's. It's boring. It gives I wanna sit in the house all day and do nothing. <laughs> that's what I <I'm>, that's <laughs> what I've been doing. There's so uh, much for kids to do up here, like the aquarium, the museum, the zoo. aquarium. Like Everything. so much. And I hate that when we when I do wanna do stuff, I have to drive all the way up here. Mm -hmm. And that's the crazy thing about Atlanta. You do have to like well about Georgia. You do have to drive to the city to do a lot of stuff. Like mm. But it's worth it though. Like the escape rooms, everything is up here. So y'all let me know how y'all like the apartment in the comments. I'm not gonna show y'all the full thing because I mean if I don't like it, I'ma show y'all the full thing. If I do like it, then I'ma show y'all certain parts, like the kitchen and shit like that. But yeah, y'all let me know if y'all think it's topping where I already live with them I think it do. Just from the pictures. From what I've seen, I definitely think it do. The outside of it, bitch, I was reading the reviews. They got all good reviews. They said it's like you living in a dream fucking hotel. Y'all need to see the fucking pool. I cannot wait to show y'all that shit. It look better than my pool? Yes. Damn. So, I'm excited. I'm really excited. Right, I'm excited. Y'all, we're going to have us a sleepover. Literally. I can't. I'm not driving all the way to McDonald's for no sleepover. Mm -hmm. I don't stay with my mama no more, so it's different.
this, a little bit mm, high maintenance, mm, everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis, with poetic justice, poetic justice, if I told you that a flower bloomed in a dark room, would you trust it, I mean I write poems in these songs, dedicated to you in, you ain't the move for empathy, there's blood in my pen, better yet for your friends and them, I really wanna know you all, I really wanna show you off, fuck God, pour up plenty of champagne, cold nights when you curse this name, you called up your girlfriends and your girls in that little bitty range, I heard that, she wanna go and party, she wanna go and party, nigga don't approach up with that Atari, nigga that ain't good game home is sorry, they say conversation, rule a nation, I can tell, but I could never write my wrongs, unless I write it down for real, P.S. Georgia State. Gonna get some work done. He's been over there playing Among Us, and we got some mangoes. Yeah. So let's see how it looks. Okay, you got no vegetables, right? Yeah. Mine look like it. Mommy, I like this. Mommy, you're not coming. That is not worth what we made. The place down the street from me, girl. Crest fills your plate up. You guys, so we just came for mangoes. This was $32. That right there was $32. Like this is crazy. This is $32. I'm not going to lie. I made this, Mommy. I made this kid a dirt. You should have went to Golden Crest. You didn't tell me mango had your plate looking like No, when I went there, my plate was full. But Plain tin. Yeah, you're nasty. Oh my god, these heavy heavy. Can I touch that? Yeah. Wait. Have you ever tried the veggie one? No. Mm. I don't like vegetables for real. Mm. I should have known because you didn't get no fresh hand. I hate rabbits. Okay, this is my first time trying a beef patty. Okay. Tastes like greatness. It is good. I should have got one. Hey, do you want to try this? Nope. At home, Girl. Hey guys so that is the end of today's vlog i'm sorry i did not finish it off properly i feel like it was kind of all over the place but i still hope you guys enjoyed make sure y'all follow my editing page because if you need your youtube videos edited i'm your girl don't you see don't you see? you already see my work if you watch my videos you see my work so yeah y'all do that make sure y'all follow my business page we got a lot coming this year a lot so i'm excited are y'all excited